Welcome to today's lesson on Soroban Abacus. Um, today we're going to learn a concept called Little Friends. Um, in math, people call it complements. That would be complements. Uh, however, for the sake of ease and simplicity, we're going to call it little friends. Oops, can't remember the spelling of friends. So what are complements? Let's take a base 5. So the range is 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. A complement of 1 would be 4, Complement of 2 would be 3. Complement of 3 would be 2. And 4 would be 1. Now obviously, 5 is the base, so there won't be any complement there. So these are the complements, or what we call them little friends. Let's just practice a little bit about these little friends a little more. Sorry about that. Still getting used to this new software. So, base is 5 always in our case especially so let's start with one two three and four so a little friend of one is four of two three three is two and four is one now Let's get our abacus. And see how these little friends help us in our calculations. So here we have our abacus set up. Let's take our abacus and reset it. Let's set it to one, up one, up one. Now let's add four. So we're gonna say up four, but hey, wait a second. We only have three beats down here. So how are we going to move up 4? Now let's go back to what we learned in our section of complements or little friend as we call them. So we need to do up 4 in order for this addition. 
So, now that we don't have four beads, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna find a little friend of four. So in order to move up four, what we need to do is move up five and down one. Little friend of four, if you remember, is one. So our base being five, up five, down one. The little friend of four is one. So here we have it. One plus four is five. Let's do that again. One plus four is what we want to do. One. Up four. But we don't have four beats. So we're going to find the little friend of four. Which is one. So we're going to say up five down one up five and down one one plus four is five let's go ahead and reset it let's go ahead and try another example something very simple let's move up three and now we want to add two. So three plus two. But wait a minute. We are in the same situation as our previous problem. We don't have enough earthly beads. Three plus two, but we only have one. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna find a little friend of two. Three plus two. So let's find a little friend of two which is three. So what are we gonna do? Up five, down three. Up five, down three. And there we go, three plus two is five. Let's redo it one more time. Three plus two, so up three. We need to do up two, but again, we don't have enough earthly bees so by finding or we already know the little friend of two is three so we're gonna move up five and move down the little friend which is three and we have the answer five now let's go ahead and try one more what is four plus three? Four plus three. So up four. Wow, we don't even have a single bead left. Four plus three. So what's the little friend of three? Two. So let's see what it turns out to be up five and down the little friend which is two down the little friend what are we left with five plus one plus one seven four plus three is seven so i hope you understand this concept well of complements um, Throughout the remainder of the video and the following videos, we're going to use the terminology little friend. So we want to make sure that you remember really well the little friends at the base level 5 with the ranges 1 through 4. So little friend of 4 is 1, little friend of 3 is 2, 
little friend of two is three and a little friend of one is four so let's try one more let's do four plus four so up four plus four well same situation we don't have enough beads so what are we gonna do we're gonna imply the little friend of four which is one so up five and down one four plus four and we get eight <laughs> 